What's going on guys? Tom here with Team Golden Age coming at you with another deck profile here. Uh, just got top 8 at the Core TCG uh, Regional. Uh, so far the biggest regional of the year. Uh, Copium. Um, playing some something I've been playing for a while but a couple shout outs first. Shout outs to the old man, the godfather himself, Adam, for just being there for support all day. Shout outs to Paul for playing in the same event. Uh, even though he didn't get the results he wanted. Shout out to Walker and uh, Cam for also playing today in the other regional. And then I guess uh, just shout out Justin McDonald and Lorenzo for not playing today because uh, Lorenzo's a bum. But let's get into this deck profile. Uh, we played a Tri Brigade uh, with a little bit of uh, purple cards in it. Uh, we played a standard. Tri Brigade Engine, 3 Fractal, 3 Kit, 3 Nerval, uh, 2 Karis. Uh, I really don't think there's anything that needs to be explained about that. Uh, we played 2 Cat, uh, just because sometimes if you see 3, it's a brick. Um, but you just want this card to resolve, and if you do, you win. Uh, another engine that if it resolves, you just kind of win is uh, the DPE Engine. Um, this card just the best card in the game. Uh, I, I don't know why any of this is legal uh, at all. Um, then, uh, for hand traps, uh, we played three Ash. I wanted something going first, or, uh, game one that just was kind of generic. I know some people aren't playing Ash, or have talked about how bad it is right now. Um, I just want some good generic against, uh, different matchups. Like, there are matchups where just, Ash is just not impactful at all. Um, but I, I just want, like I said, want something that was, uh, pretty generic. But then I played Droll. I just wanted something that, here, that... Um, I, I know they kind of clash sometimes, but I wanted something that just would, uh, if I drew it and it resolves, I'm going to likely win that game. Uh, even though two of the three times I did resolve roll today, uh, I actually lost that game. Uh, then for other interruptions, we play three droplet and, um, three imperm, uh, just hitting your opponent's DPE is just too good right now. Uh, these cards are just insane. Um... I played three Cosmic in the main. I didn't want to lose to any kind of, like, DPE artifact uh, BS. Um, I didn't want to lose to, like... I, I don't know. There just seems like there was a lot of good uh, trap cards running around the format. I just didn't want to lose anything. You never know what to expect at a regional. And um, I, I kind of thought this was a, a decent meta call going uh, first. It didn't come up any games going first. Um... So these might become Pot of Prosperities again, which is what I had been playing. Uh, then for just good one-ofs, uh, Call by the Grave, Tanky, Foolish. Foolish is another starter. Uh, because I cut Prosperity from what I had been playing, uh, we're playing 3 Revolt. Uh, this card seemed to be glued to my hand all day, hard drawing it, which makes your combo so much nicer because you can end on so many more things than uh, dealing with the bear and locking yourself into Tri Brigades for the rest of the turn. Um, and then you just follow that up with a revolt and then uh, last but not least i don't know why this card's legal either um i didn't really see it today but this card just cracked uh for the extra deck it is two ferret uh one bear uh, i have been playing two with the uh prosperity build i think i might bump it back up to two because the cards i kind of replaced it with just didn't do anything all day uh one rugel uh, and two Shurag. Uh, playing three, this would have come up, I think, a couple times, or just would have made like, my lines a little bit di more different and made my life easier. Uh, the one Al Mirage, the one DDL, Verte, Eagle, Access Code, Appaloosa, and DPE. All, I think, pretty standard stuff for this deck at this point in time. Uh, and then the two cards I decided to play, uh, but did not come up once at all. Um, Sky Cavalry and Zeus. Uh, I understand why to play them, but it just never came up, so they might become a second bear and a third um, Shurag once again. Uh, then lastly for the side deck, uh, I wanted to play blowout cards, um, just stuff that was going to be super impactful if I drew it. Uh, really the only time I saw any of my side deck cards was in um, the last round, game two, where I saw uh, four side deck cards uh, in my opening hand and it was just like ah cool no engine uh we played alpha um alpha honestly uh kind of it's been in and out of tri-brigade decks for a while 
Uh, I wanted something that could apply pressure, uh, bounce DPEs, force DPEs. Uh, then it's also good against Sword Soul because uh, it can trade with a Chichao. Uh, it can trade with a Barone if they end on Barone. Um, just because it's got that 3k attack, so you can run into things. Um, it just forces a lot of stuff, especially in the grind game. Uh, plus it puts a body on the board, and it can be um, another target in the graveyard for your um, Tri-Brigade effects or to add it off of uh, the Shurag if it gets uh, sent to Grave and you have you know a lot of banner stuff. Uh, Dark Ruler, and then uh, Evenly. Uh, so these were the, the nine cards I cited for going second most of the time. Um, just kind of dependent on the matchup, like if I cited Dark Ruler or Evenly. But if, like, if I was prepared to go second, these were the nine cards that typically came in, and then you kind of just kind of uh, deal with, you know, is Cosmic good in this matchup? Is Droll good in this matchup? Is Ash good in this matchup? Um, but all are super impactful if you draw them, and then just kind of hope to draw one of these with your engine. Um, and then uh, lastly was our going first cards of Solemn Judgment and Anti-Spell. Um, spell cards are really good right now and just slowing my opponent down for a turn usually can win me the game. And Judgment just, you know, stops blowout cards. It just literally stops anything. Uh, the only time I saw this today was when I drew it uh, in a pair and I just won the game because I had double Judgment. If not, um, Prank Kids probably was going to play through just about uh, anything. But uh, that's it. Once again, got 8th place at the uh, Core TCG reg Remote Dual Regional today. My first Remote Dual Regional of the season. Um, I'd like to shout out uh, here at the end Patriot Games for sponsoring us as well as Croc Cards. And remember to like and subscribe for more.